Good morning. Hey, Bobby. Good morning. How are you? I'm great. And how are you? How is it going for you? I'm good. I'm good. It's going to be a busy day for me. So I'm going to have to um, do this part of the meeting quick. Um, and I'm if sure. we have any more questions, I have some time um, in the earlier part of the morning. I mean, or later part of the morning. But let's go through this. So did anybody sign up? I'm looking. Let me share my screen. Yeah, yeah. I, I think... Uh, Yes, uh, Gianluca, if I'm not pronouncing it wrong. So yes, he signed up for uh, for being uh, uh, for supporting us with the GitHub and the templates part. And, oh, cool. uh, yeah, he won't be able to join the meeting. He uh, mentioned that to me on LinkedIn, uh, but he would like to support on the GitHub and templates part. And he would also like to, you know, present his thoughts in tomorrow's meeting. That's what he said to me. Perfect. So yeah. um, I think the two of you should do the presentation. Um, did you, were you able to grab some uh, templates anywhere for Hyperledger? And Yeah, and... yeah, I did it. I did it. Let me share. Oh, well, then do you want to share your screen? Yeah, yeah, I am sharing that. Oh, Pajal's on too. Great. We can yeah. have a piece there. Let me just give you permission. Hold on. Uh, more participants. Uh, is it visible? Yes, it is now. Yeah, yeah. So, so I think uh, my screen is visible. Or we're, oh, we're on the same screen. That's so funny. Uh, yeah. So, okay. So, yeah, as uh, we had to prepare two slides. So, this is the slide that I prepared where I will be introducing the document standard course and write of and discuss a few, just two lines about uh, why documentation is important and then introduce the sub community committees of uh, the documentation standards task force. And in the the next slide, I've prepared a table where uh, if whoever signs up for, you know, uh, contributing to the to any of the five groups or committees, uh, they will, you know, share their thoughts and what they are interested in contributing. So these are the two slides that I made. Perfect. Um, yeah. I do have a suggestion if you go back to the first slide. So these two slides um, are more geared to all the new mentees who know nothing about, you know, the next couple months and what they're going to go through, kind of like you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So um, this slide is great introduction to the documentation task force. I would say, you know, um, when you you give this slide, just say that, you know, the, the task force has been around, you know, for a few months and now we're, you know, really getting um, organized this summer to, to knock out the rest of these, you know, um, the, the, these things that we're focused on. Um, and I would um, mention all of those points. And then um, on the second slide, I would change that slide a little bit. Yeah, sure. Let me like. Uh, yeah, um, because I, I don't. Can... Go ahead. I'm. Uh, let me like. Uh, okay, let me give you give the right access to everyone so that you know you can make the changes. Editor. I can share the link. I'm sharing the link in the chat. Perfect. Yeah, so yes. now you can also make the changes. Okay, great. Thank you. Yeah. So so to me, this, this second slide, um, so you're introducing yourself as like the main contact in the first slide and, and saying, you know, like each one of your projects that you're working on obviously needs some documentation piece. Um, the documentation task force has so many places you can go for resources and then list, you know, those, those bullet points in the first one um, that, you know, will help you with your GitHub repository, will help you make sure it has the right stuff, or, or you might want to put that um, off for a second um, and just say, we're here to help you with the following things. And then um, mention each one of those things like I usually do in the meetings. And okay. then on the second slide, I would give that up to, um, so let me just double check. So um, Kajal, are you going to be at the presentation tomorrow for the mentees? Uh, I have talked to the mentee of the Bevel. Uh, you have told me to ask him like uh, to present in the next meet of the yes, and I saw, task force. Yeah, uh, and I yes. saw your email about inviting him to the meeting. I would invite him to next Monday's. Okay, uh, so I asked him. And you also told like we, uh, we have to... Uh, write uh, write the uh, project uh, on which we are going to assist. So I would like to assist uh, uh, the Bevel mentee 
in their early designing bevel or documentation of project uh, uh, we have to uh, give them the tools and all the best practices we are offering right so i would like to assist him in that perfect so um if you can make the mentorship meeting now i'm just checking for a second let me just double check i asked min if she could put the meeting link for tomorrow on the um main calendar let's see if she did that um come on my computer is so slow i apologize all the time for this so wednesday let's see is it on here cactus labs solang aries firefly cactus no they haven't put it on the main meeting yet um so um a lot of new people came and hopefully everybody can be at that mentor meeting. I think it's at 11. Is it Arunima? Is it 11? Uh, okay. I don't know. Uh, it got added to my Google calendar. Let me show you. So here it just automatically, and it is showing me 7.30 to 8.30 PM in Indian standard time. Okay. So that's what time is it there for you now? For me now it is 6.30. So around this time. Okay, so it will be at 10 o'clock. Okay, so 10 o'clock tomorrow, who's ever on the call and wants to present, we'd love to have you. So what's going to happen is um, Arunima is going to go to the, we only get two slides, so she's going to go to her first slide. You want to go back to that one? And she's going to introduce the group and the different areas that we're helping people and that we're offering assistance. And then I think we should go to the second slide. Yeah. And um, you know, maybe um, instead of saying introduce to committee members, um, maybe call this reach out and then let um, Kajal um, speak for a second and maybe put the Bevel logo on there and say, you know, Bevel has a team. I'm going to be the liaison and, you know, let, you know, Kajal, you'll just introduce what how you're going to help that project with their documentation. And then um, Agnes or um, I know. Uh, Gia Luca wants to talk uh, more about the GitHub, so he can say, and if any of these, you know, have him say something. Um, so let me see if I can figure this out. So I, I don't know how you want to do it, and I'm going to like let you guys figure that out. But so have this second slide for everyone who wants to offer assistance to the mentees, have their name and, and, and a contact. So like Kajal will say, I'm helping with Bevel and you can have the Bevel logo there. So here's my name and contact for anyone who has any, any questions about what that looks like. And then um, I know G. Luca wants to talk about GitHub. So have his name there maybe with the Git, with a GitHub logo or I don't know what you would do for GitHub. Um, Cause you always wanna have pictures on a slide. People don't like to just look at words. Um, so have, um, his picture and his contact information and saying, if you're starting your um, GitHub repository for a new lab, um, come see us, we'll tell you what you need to have in it. If you wanna make read the docs from it, come to us, or maybe Agnes can take that part saying, you know, um, Gianluca can take the part maybe where it says um, what needs to be in the GitHub repository and anyone who is familiar with um, read the docs, Sphinx or those pro programs can say, you know, here's my contact number. If you need help with this, call me. So I unfortunately have to run out the door at 10 after. I'm going to leave this room open for you guys. And I know G. Luca isn't here, but he wanted that one piece. So um, instead of like, maybe this table is great. Um, but make it less of a table and more of a like a grid. So like there's, um, so it's bigger and it just like has four grids for whoever the people who are talking. Um, and then you would introduce them, Arunima, on the second slide, you would say, and we have, uh, you know, we're broken out into different committees to get this job done. Um, and if somebody wants to even talk about just the four personas, that would be great too. You know, we know that there's different people going to be reading your work. Do you need different user guides for different personas? Come contact me. So there's a lot of different areas we can specifically offer help in emails during this meeting. Because again, these, these are the new mentees and mentors, and they've, they've never done this before, so they don't know what they need. Um, so we just want to be that like beacon of light there for them. Um, I'm going to turn the meeting over to Arunima and let you guys continue. Yeah, so, uh, Bobby, I had a question. Like, how do you think that we can modify this slide, the second one? Um, 
Okay, let me see. Do I have? Okay, I'm going to share my screen. So stop sharing your screen real quick. Yeah, this yeah. Is the only sure. I think I could do this. Yeah. Okay, so I opened that. So that's opened right here. So what I usually do is before I do anything, I make a duplicate slide. Are you guys seeing my screen? Yeah, yeah, we can see it. So what is this? this is not what I wanted. So I usually just make a duplicate slide and I mess with that one. And I always. Uh, but we can, uh, we can, we are, cannot see the slides. I can just see the install Docker Compose and a command line prompt. Really? Hold on. How's that? Yeah, now it's uh, it's showing. Okay. Okay, so what I would probably do with this is, and again, I just do stuff quick, I don't know. Um, I would get rid of this line. And I would put, I would insert a row below. And I would put everybody's name here who wants to talk. And then I would put what they want to talk about. So he definitely wants to talk more about GitHub. So he would say, you know, and there's two GitHub things we're offering. We're offering help with what should be in your GitHub repository. And then we're offering help on how to take that and make it read the docs. So there should be two people with contacts. And then I would just put his contact information here. Ah, damn it. Sorry. Bad French. And then just put his email here. Um, and then I would like format the table nicer. So kind of like maybe get rid of the uh, the lines so it doesn't look so grid-like, I don't know. Or even, I don't know, let me see. What do I want? Here we go. Oh, I don't know what I want. Um, I want a picture, just a basic picture, just to catch your eye on something hyperledger. So, oh, here. Oh, here we go. Let me see what these are. You know, you could say, you know, that's just an image I threw out there. Any image you want to use, just something, whether it has um, a bevel or just a picture of the mentorship program, um, you know, any way to make it just more interesting. You can even, I uh, sometimes would do um, insert anything, any image from... Uh, See, I'm used to using PowerPoint, so this is tough for me. Um, you know, the clipboard and then put some color on it. So like for GitHub, you could do like a, a notepad page. Um, and for Bevel, you know, when when um, we're discussing the, the Bevel connection and, and how Kajal is going to, you know, be working closely, maybe put the Bevel logo there. Um, and it doesn't even have to be in a table. You can just do squares like you can insert. And I'm not sure if I can do this with this. Yeah, I'll use a text box and just put all the information, whatever, put all the information for uh, GitHub help. And you can even put like an American Red Cross, you know, like a, a cross there because we're trying to help you or something. And then, you know, have uh, the names of the people who want to do that. Um, Again, so there's there's a lot of different. I'm I'm getting confusing. Um, I know, and I apologize for that. Um, okay, but so at the, like yeah, at the end of the your, day, go ahead. Yeah, I mean, instead of just doing a table format, uh, we can add some pictures and make it more interactive so that it looks better. That's what you mean, right? Yes, and then like for instance, when you go to this slide, say, uh, Gianluca is going to go first. 
you're going to um, have, um, I would put animations on it so that when he's talking about GitHub, his name and GitHub is on there. And then um, when uh, Kajal's talking about Bevel, slide her information in, in a group. Do you know how to do that on animations? Uh, I can Google it and see if I can do that. Um, usually, again, on Microsoft PowerPoint, there's a button on here that says animate. And then you just click the, the graphic and, and say slide in and it's animated. <laughs> and then okay, you click on the I next one and the next one comes in. So I'm sure on this, there's the same way. So it's just um, the order in which they fly in because then people are interested if they just see the one thing that you're talking about rather than the whole slide right away. So they're I like, oh, okay, it. this is easy. And then yeah, slide it. Column. And then so um, I'm going to head out now. I'm going to leave this open and this. Yep. Um, you just when you're finished, Arunaman, um, either send it to Min um, and me or just me first if you want me to look at it again, which is really not necessary because I trust you. Okay, um, I got it. But just organize these guys on the call so they all have a role in tomorrow's presentation. Yeah, sure. I'm doing that. Okay, thank you. Have a great day and yeah, I'll be around you. again in the afternoon. Bye. Yeah, yeah, sure. Okay. Akanksha, you wanted to ask, right? Yeah. Okay. So what you wanted to ask maybe okay, you can ask it on Thursday's meet. Uh, Thursday's meet. Tomorrow is the meet, right? Yeah, we what will meet people? tomorrow also. You can ask tomorrow also. Yeah, I think so. I, I'll wait for tomorrow only. Right now, like what exactly I can do for the presentation. Uh sorry, what did you say? Uh, am I audible? Yeah, yeah, you are audible. I'm just saying, like, uh, what can I contribute for the presentation? Because, uh, like, I'll... so, so I think, uh, there is, there is a part. Uh, one of the five areas is the onboarding, onboarding. part, also, right? And you are working yeah. on the onboarding part only. Yeah. So maybe you can uh see a few lines on onboarding. Uh, and... Should I prepare a slide for that? Based on the no, information. No, 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 no. I don't think because as uh, as she said that uh for our uh, our uh, like the documentation task force we have just got only two slides so one slide will be the first one where uh, i will be introducing the five areas where the uh, the whole uh, like the documentation task force will be providing support with the projects and in the second part we will be introducing uh, everyone who is uh, going to participate here so since one of the part is onboarding so in that part you can uh, write a few lines about you and you know like uh, you can just write now and send it to me or you can send it to me on whatsapp or linkedin any way you prefer and i, I will okay. add that here okay regarding onboarding right yeah yeah regarding onboarding just a few lines two to three okay. lines two to three lines okay because yeah, of yeah. course you have to cover all the topics the, so uh, do i have to speak it tomorrow with you in the presentation uh sorry uh, tomorrow in the pre presentation, do I need to speak along with? Do you have to give presentation together, or you will be doing that? No. Once I introduce the five areas, after that I will be introducing one by one. Whoever is like me, whether you are a mentee or a not, or just contributing, you all can just mm -hmm. introduce yourself and say okay. the area you are working on. Since you are a mentee for the onboarding part, you can also mm -hmm. like write your name there and just speak a few lines mm -hmm. on okay. onboarding part. Okay, got it, got it. I am yeah. clear about it. I'll share you with the, you know, the lines that I would yeah, like yeah. to see. And uh, try sending it uh, by today so that, you know, I can yeah. just make the animations and uh, send mm -hmm. it to uh, Min and Bobby for, uh, yeah. for they can also like just uh, mm -hmm. attach it to the main presentation. Okay, I'll try to send it by 10 or 11 today only. Yeah, 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 sure. Um, also like... Uh, uh, this presentation is like tomorrow in the kickoff uh, kickoff session or it's a different session no no in the kickoff session only you okay. must have be having the link right we i didn't get any mail yet Do, did you get any mail today okay i will be i uh, just remind me i will be sharing with you the link just drop a message to me on whatsapp on linkedin i will okay. share the zoom link with you okay but, uh, like just ask me did you get a mail today for that no, I didn't get a mail today, but I have the link. Okay, okay, please share, share it, share it with you. Yeah. Thank you, thank you so much. And also, like, how did you like get the link for this one? Because 
I don't know why I lost bit in between the links. So I, I don't know. Like maybe uh, 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 along with the mail, it just got added to my calendar meet. Just okay. the Google calendar I use, it got added there. Okay, I guess it's added in mine also because, I, but I wasn't sure that this is the link. I just check it if this it's the same link, so that's why I asked yeah, it yeah. from you. I check it out. Yeah. Okay, I'll send you the uh, lines by today itself. And yeah, if yeah, anyone sure. like to this, please let me know. I'll help you. Out. Yeah, yeah, I will let you know. Okay, thank you. Yeah, welcome. And Kajal and Agnes, hi. 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 So. Hi. Uh, so uh, same for you like as you all will also be contributing this summer to help improve the documentation you can also just write uh, mention your area of interest and write two to three lines about it and send it to me in any way you can send it to me as a text on linkedin okay let me just add your names here only um. Uh, do we have to write about what we are contributing or what we are offering? Like, uh, what we have to write. So, if you let's say if you are not sure of what to contribute, you can just introduce yourself, explain your skill set and interest, and then say that uh, if a, a like among the five buckets, you can just choose uh, the area in which you want to contribute. Like, you want to contribute to GitHub or you want to contribute to the onboarding part or uh, the user guides, choose any one area and like give your contact information, like your email ID, so that you know if the team needs the needs help okay. in that area, they can contact you. Okay. And what about the bevel? Uh, I have to introduce to uh, them also. Uh, sorry, can you be a bit loud? Uh, uh, I was saying, like, uh, I have to also mention about bevel. Anything you want to mention? Actually, I, I have uh, I have texted to their mentor, but they haven't replied anything. But I texted to the mentee, and I talked to him like, oh, does he need any help or anything? Because we will be offering the tools and all, right? Yeah, so yeah. He's, so he said like he is interested uh, in this. So, like he ha hasn't talked to his mentor yet. So I'm like a bit confused. Uh, like we have to. So maybe uh, just you can see that I had a conversation with one of the Pebel mentees, and uh, since they have a, they have they need help in this area, I'm willing to offer that help to them. You can just see okay. this. Okay. Cool. Okay. Okay. Whatever you write, make sure that you sum it up in two to three lines. Don't write a complete essay on it. Okay. 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 And cool. uh, do you like? Do you have my email ID? Let me share my email ID with you. Just okay. give me a minute. Either on email or on LinkedIn. Any way you, uh, whatever suits you, just uh, send it to me. Two to okay. three lines that you would like to speak on, so that I can add it to the presentation. Cool. Can I ask something? Yeah, sure. Please go ahead and ask. Uh, I, I was thinking maybe we can also add uh, the four personas. I don't know what they are <laughs> at this point. Uh, sorry, what did you in, say? Uh, the four personas that uh, Bobby four was personas. talking about. I'm still now not very clear about what these four personas are, to be honest. Okay, so yeah. maybe, like, do you have an idea about them? No, but I guess I, I guess they are user guide or for onboarding process. I guess. Sorry, but uh, they are uh, five, not four. That's what I'm also confused about, and I have to clear uh, that out. Like, yes, we can ask Bobby. Yeah, we have to ask Bobby. Yeah, I think we can confirm because I think it will be an important thing to think about as we document since it will guide on how we will we'll write the documentation because we will be knowing for whom we are writing. So I think if you're able to confirm, I don't know, I think I sent you a LinkedIn connection. I'm okay, not sure. so like, uh, uh, let me just sum it up. Like for now, we are just focusing on completing tomorrow's presentation. Okay, so if you have any doubts, you can ask in tomorrow's yeah. meet. 
so uh, since uh, like you want to contribute and so you will also be uh, giving a small talk about you, uh, uh, like sharing about your interest and experience in tomorrow's meet so what do you want to talk about tomorrow i'm not sure <laughs> probably the personas but i don't know what the exact for are so i don't know okay so uh, since you are not sure and since i am also exactly not sure by four personas what she meant i would uh, like let me ask you a few question is there any project that you are particularly interested in yeah i attended uh indi uh ari and bezu but i'm i'm looking for python more more python related projects since i'm more familiar with it okay so i'll probably be contributing around indi or ari or there's another no store there's a, an upcoming meeting like an hour a ca pi or something okay so okay yeah. i got it so in your talk you can just see that currently i am exploring all the hyperledger projects and figuring out what best matches my interest and then you can yeah. add on that uh, you know i attended these these meetings and uh, if you figured out that they have any documentation uh, gaps that you want to fill up you can talk about them a bit and then you can said but i am also looking for more python related project and these are my skill sets and uh, if uh, you need any help uh, help and if any of the needs or requirements matches my skill sets and interests please free to fill through contact me and kajal for you also please share your email address because we have to write that also on the slide so that if anyone needs that Yeah, any sure. any yeah so share your email address with me and same you for agnes also just share your email address with me okay so that i can mention that in the slides oh okay thank you so much all right i think that's that's a good place to start then maybe later on we can confirm about the personas yeah okay and in the end maybe you can ask that uh ask bobby to you know more clearly explain you about the personas okay all right all right yeah so uh, for both kajal and agnes uh, please send me two to three lines uh, on which you will be talking about so that i can add it to the presentation and i just can just complete it if possible please send it in a few hours or, or to me on either linkedin or you can just send me on email i shared my email okay. in the chat okay yeah. so that i can right. add it to the presentation Okay. No problem. No problem. Yes. At uh, what time is the meeting tomorrow? Ah, uh, so ah, uh, okay. Let me just check. I will be the tomorrow's meeting is ah uh, scheduled on seven thirty to eight thirty p.m. IST Indian Standard Time. But ah, uh, like since it automatically got added to my calendar, maybe you know, ah, uh, you can just no, do no. the required uh, conversion. the there is the main uh, the main meeting which is 10 10 am edt i think i saw that which is yeah yeah over. yeah it will be 10 10 am edt we are going to have another one like before it or this is like our last sort of preparation meeting uh, i couldn't understand what you are asking so there's the main mentee like welcome welcoming mentees meeting which is what we are preparing the slides for yes yes tomorrow we have the welcoming mentees ment uh, meeting so, so whoever We're wants going to have another one like our own before that what do you mean by our own like uh, our the own one we are having now okay. sorry are we going to have another meeting to sort of prepare or do like final touches uh, before no the there will be no another meeting so we have okay. for the documentation task force team we have been yeah. given to uh, given only two slides to share in the first slide i will be just sharing the five areas that we will be providing support to the uh, to the various projects on the five areas as i said they are github templates user guides and all those and in the second slide we will be introducing all the all all of you whoever is uh, wanting to provide support so one by one i will just create an animation so that you know one by one uh, i can just uh, show like show everyone so maybe first uh, kajal will go then agnes you will go then someone else whoever signs up maybe uh, he or she can go so that how it okay. will 
yeah, I think just prepare. Be... Yeah, just uh, for the part that you will be talking on, just uh, prepare for it. And even if you make a mistake, that's no problem. Okay, just it's a basic introduction so that uh, you know you can get involved with the community and. To be honest, we all are still confused. We all are trying to figure out more and know more how the community is working. So it's okay. It will just be a normal introduction, like you introduce yourself in the course. Will be like that. So nothing to worry about. Okay, no problem. Yeah. Uh, could you please share the meeting link? Tomorrow's uh, of tomorrow's meet. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Let me just share it with you. Uh, here you go. I shared it in the chat. Okay, let me just add it to my calendar. All right, I think that's it from my end. Unless maybe there's anything else left. Uh, Agnes, did you say anything? Do you have any problem? No, I'm saying I think that's it for the meeting. Or is there okay. anything else? No, discuss. that's it. Just make sure that uh, since you will be speaking, both you and Kajal tomorrow. So just send me a few lines so that I can add it to the presentation about both of you. And your contact information, that is your email ID or your phone number, whatever you want to give as contact, make sure you share it with me so that I can share it, into, uh, share it add it to the slide. Is okay. it fine okay. for both of you? Yes. 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 Yeah, yeah. So that's it for today's meeting. Um, thank you so much. And welcome to both of you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Have a good one. Yeah, have a great day. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.